What's up YouTube, YouTube world, YouTube fans, YouTube soon to become fans. I am your host, Tech Connection. What other way to kick off this video than to start it off with, well, you see it right up here. Yeah, the Dell Precision T7500. You gonna be getting the first glimpse of me blowing this dusty computer out. Sounds like it's raining outside. Uh -uh. Nope, no colors. Uh uh. Nope, you're, you're not going outside. No. No. You're not going outside. Turn on light. Yep. It is raining outside, as y'all can see. <clears throat> Yep, it is a raining outside him. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff out here that we're gonna be doing when it's not raining. But uh, yeah, it's raining out here. Enough of all of this raining here. So uh, what I had done was, is I had put uh, caster wheels on this puppy. Wife's dad. They told me that this right here actually uh, was in some type of bank or something like that. And this right here is all cast iron. Maybe in a, another video, I may be uh, taking like some metal or something and putting up under here. Uh, to try to block some of this off. All right, so let's get this puppy out of here. And uh, man, it's a wreck out of here. All this crap. Anyway, let's get the precision out of here and let's do it. Uh, man, I'll tell you, you two, this puppy here is heavy, very heavy. Uh, right here, almost uh, kind of reminds me of like wielding out like a casket. All right, so we got the Dell Precision T7500 out here. If y'all wonder how I done that, I guess you want to call it like a little camera trick or whatever with the Manfrotto. Yeah, this right here is real good for like mounting stuff. I just had the camera just sitting up there like that. And uh, thought it'd be pretty cool, but now we're gonna have to switch over to the, this right here is, I want to say maybe this is vintage. I'm not real sure, but anyway, yeah, uh, I know this tripod head here is for sure. It's how dirty this thing is. Very dirty. And we got some information up here too. I don't care about y'all knowing all that, but yeah. So we're gonna uh, first put y'all on the tripod stand. Then we're gonna throw you up on the uh, table here. And yeah, so I'm gonna show y'all what I use to clean this bad boy here out. So let's go ahead and let's do it. Mm -hmm. This thing here is pretty heavy, so try to save as much back breaking as I can. Be very careful with this thing. Uh. 
There's that. Let's get this out of the way. Dust flying already. It's kind of good like that. I got my cable a little routed like this. There's that. All right. So here's the. Power supply right here. I believe this right here is uh, 1100 watts. You see it, I uh, just pointed out, or if I'm wrong, just uh, let me know. <clears throat> we got uh, one, two, three uh, uh, hard drives. I forgot to make sure that I get all the power out of this thing. But anyway, uh, yeah, we got a, uh, forget how big this solid state drive is. I'm going to replace it. It's kind of just sitting up in there. Then we got the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1060. I'm going to eventually replace it too as well. We got the uh, Intel Xeon 5680. Uh, we got the riser board. Uh, we got 24 gigs here and also here we also got uh, 24 more gigs this right here is the original Dell memory look how dirty this is hey okay. <laughs> but yeah I mean pretty dirty so it ain't that bad but you know mainly it's like the front Look at this. Hmm. Yummy. Haven't had any trouble with the fans, nothing like that. Uh, nor this fan, nothing like that. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's clean this. Let's clean this thing here out. Blow it on out real good, and let's uh. Get it cleaned up because it needs it. This right here is what I use to uh, it's just an air mattress pump. I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna start blowing it out. I should have got y'all the shot of uh well it's uh right over here all this all this crap right here see all that uh I screwed it up man I really should have got y'all a way better shot uh but yeah ah uh, idiot Pop off uh, this front panel right here. Uh, this right here, you just hold down on this, and boom, it's got all kind of dust and crap like that up in there. If the fans start to spin up in here, I can always get like a little screwdriver and uh, put up in, run up in through here. And yeah, that's all that problem. I need to grab a flathead screwdriver. I don't know if y'all can see that on cam. It's not good to let the fans spin. I think it would be kind of hard to ruin the bar bearings. I can't pronounce that word good, whatever. We'll just go for it.
All right, so now uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to remove. Oh, I need to uh, disconnect this right here. It's a eight pin connector. Carefully, carefully. Am I in the way? Do that. Now I got a video where I had posted on me actually fixing this. Got a lot of views, got a lot of people's attention. It helped a lot of people actually. We'll talk about that here in a moment. Uh, the screwdriver fit back here. Yeah, that's, yeah, right back there. Alright, so uh, we went ahead and we got uh, this bad boy right right here uh, all nice and cleaned up. Just used the brush. Uh, before we pop it on, I want to point out this guy right here. This thing right here is a pile of crap. At one time it did work. I mean it works, but honestly and truly, uh, it just doesn't read uh, cars or whatever. Right now on my Panasonic HTC TM900 camcorder, I'm using a, uh, it's just a, uh, it's a SD card, and then you have the micro SD card in it now. I can't remember if it if it does it with the uh, other part or whatever, but the regular SD card. I show y'all what I use. I put it on screen or something. So anyway, let's go ahead and let's carry on with this VTO. All right, so I know I said I was going to show y'all that cable or whatever is running from the back of the computer, which is back here, and it's like that see it right there and you have this right here that right there is done kind of rubbed off but I'll leave a link uh, down in the description but all I do is all I do is I just take it I just run it like this I feed it through the front arm was kind of in the way but yeah uh, I just do it like that right there and then it just kind of does that right there all right so uh, here's the riser board itself Ain't really that dirty, I mean, just give it like a little wipe down, whatever. As you can pretty much tell, well right up here, a little, little dusty, I mean, not bad at all. Puppy here. Alright, all right. so uh, there we have that right there. Here is the Dell Precision C7500 in all its glory. It's still a little dust. And uh yeah, I mean, but for the most part, check it out. Heat sink, all that. This right here. Well, we know that right there is nice and polished up. This thing here. This here. Slide it on up in there. Get your cable out the way. You feel it stop. You're pushing it until it stop. Push on the left and right side. Boom. You may not think it's in there. It's in there. Next thing you want to do is you want to just get your cable, your eight pin cable, plug it in. You hear it click. There you go. Oh, well, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Uh, on the Dell Precision T7500. One thing I will uh, also like to point out too as well, if you get your computer back to your desk uh, and you get it all hooked up and say like if you're uh, having 
problem, say like with maybe you don't know, you're getting like some uh, amber orange lights or something like that, uh, try reseating your memory because I had that same trouble. So peace out and I'm Tech Connections and see you in the next video.